interference when two or more waves superimposed to each other with the same phase difference so phase represented by phi or delta as you like so same frequency and here this is same amplitude same amplitude then the maximum and minimum intensity of fringes light fringes observed on the screen that is called interference of light when two light waves superimposed with the same phase phi same frequency nu and same amplitude a then the maximum and minimum intensity fringes of lights observed on the screen phenomena is called interference of light so what are the conditions to get sustained interference so first one already we discussed the two light sources emitting light waves should be coherent should be coherent they should with the same phase and constant phase difference if two waves are having the same phase the waves are coherent waves the two light sources emitting light waves should be coherent coherent so second one the two sources must emit continuous light waves of same wavelength and same frequency so continuous light waves it produces continuous wavelength same wavelengths and the same frequency the two sources must emit continuous light waves of same wavelength lambda and the same frequency nu third one the two so sources should be separated by a small distance between the two sources the distance is very small the two sources should be separated by small distance fourth one you see here fourth one the distance between two sources and the screen should be large so here to view interference fringes the screen background should be dark should be dark the amplitude of sixth one the amplitude of the light waves should be equal or nearly equal nearly equal seventh one the two sources should be narrow we should take narrow sources narrow slits they must be small last point the sources should be monochromatic mono means single chromatic means wavelength if it has a single wavelength light for example sodium vapor lamp sodium sodium vapor lamp that lambda is equal to 5893 angstroms 5893 angstroms yellow colored sodium vapor lamp light wave 5893 angstroms the source should be monochromatic 